What's up guys? So I saw this come up like ASAP. I ran over here. I want to check it out. So this is a waterfront house. Right backs up to uh, Lake Tarpon, only like one lot away. It's an awesome location, right? It's a huge house, monstrous house. But as you can see, this is the street, a one-way street. This is not owned by us. It's owned by a developer that's probably going to put townhouses, so they're going to block it. Despite all that, negatives, positives, it's on the water, the positives, it's a huge house. So depending on what deal I can get, we might be flipping this one next. I'll see you inside. I mean, the flood insurance on this thing is going to be horrendous. So yeah, I'm like, unless they're giving it away for like free, like you know how I am, I'll make an offer for anything. So come here, this is the, like I said, if it was the house was over here, if it was this house, then it would have been awesome because they have, you have uh, two, you have two, uh, two water views. So this is awesome. The problem is, as you can't guarantee, no one's ever going to build there. Yeah, the, did you look on, uh, this over here was an old, well, you can tell the way. Mobile the, home park. It was an old trailer park. Yeah. They own this parcel also. So let's buy this. So, <laughs> yeah. I'd rather buy this. Put a bunch of townhomes in there. You know, I'll, you know what, for now, I'm going to put the trailer, trailers back. <laughs> Just give me you some money. Look, it's their trailer. It's not mine. They put whatever trailer they want. They just pay me lot rent. There's some trailers now. Do you know how much they sell for? 200, 250,000. The ones on oh, the water? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ones on the water? Again, they could put any trailer they want. Just pay me lot rent. <sighs> so, this is the thing. If, when they build the townhouses, this view's gone. They're gonna build. They're gonna build three-story townhouses, and this view is gonna be gone. That's exactly what they're gonna put there. It looks awesome. It looks so good. Like the water, if you're looking at it right now, it's so nice. Look at this. Look at those pretty flowers. Look at that. Great view, though. And look, it has even has the what's it called here, on your feet that you're standing on actually has seawall that is expensive really yeah very expensive like 25 or 50 feet is like basically it's a thousand dollars a foot Whoa. yeah and only a few people do it it's not like you can find anybody to do it only a few companies do it this is really nice i really really like it the the property not the house i haven't even seen the house yet but the house fyi it's an unless they're giving it away for free, it's a no buy. Trust me, don't get caught up in shit. The water is like one foot below of where the house is. Like legit, any type of anything comes this way, you're flooding. So your flood insurance is gonna be stupid expensive. So you have to buy it so, so cheap to make up for the expensive flood insurance. One person already came, drove down the street and left just cause they're like, no, <laughs> no. But as you guys know, we're not scared. We're willing to take those hard deals. Um, it just, hey, is there, is there money? If there's money, we'll talk. And for sure, this right here, right here, this needs to be thicker, bigger. This doesn't have anything. Yeah, nothing yeah, underneath. Nothing. nothing. So rip that down, put some uh, reinforcement here. Let's look at the back. Because the inside doesn't matter. Let's look at the back. This is what you're buying the house for. Location. What's good here is it's a very long lot. That's the garage there. You need additional parking. You could rip some of this up. You know what we got to do? We got to come back here, Joe, when the storm is going on. Because there's a storm coming, and we have to see what happens with the water. Look how low, how low you are to the water. Two feet and it's up. Four feet, six feet, it's in your house. 
Not even, four feet, it's in your house. And it's weird how they did it like this, like why? They must have had an original house and built on it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's definitely a, originally a 1970s beach. The low ceilings and... That's what, that, that's what That's what turned me on to the place when I sent you that message. Like... So definitely 1970s. Welcome to 1970. What's very, very, very uh, common for this type of home is the step down. That, that dipped in carpet. Now, the problem with that is, is you're on the water. That foot, you need that foot so the water doesn't come inside. Now you're basically saying, come on in, water, welcome. Make a, make a pool in my living room. So this has to be like addressed. These ceilings have to be ripped up. They even dropped this down to account for the fact that this is like, it's gotta be ripped up. Like this home has to go down to like studs before they go back at it. Check out the old school safe in here. You hear this? Underneath the boards. Piles and piles of cocaine. <laughs> no, but but there is something underneath this board that's not right. Like so, a board? but no, like a well, they, obviously all this is wood. But no joke, people would do that. Like if you pull this up, some of these older houses, you can pull this up and literally find just one board that's not been nailed down because underneath it, they're they're hiding stuff. <laughs> 